Chicago police have today released two versions of body camera footage showing the moment Harithal Augustus was shot and killed on Saturday. Police say the 37-year-old was shot multiple times after they say he reached for a weapon they suspected he was carrying under his shirt. But as Nathan Frandino from Reuters reports, his death has sparked violent protests against police brutality. The Chicago Police Department released body camera footage on Sunday that showed Harith Augustus moments before he was shot and killed by a police officer. It's the latest in a string of U.S. police killings that have at times sparked nationwide protests. This incident sparked confrontations on Saturday near the crime scene. Chicago Police Superintendent Eddie Johnson hoped the video's release would ease tensions. I made the decision to release the body-worn camera footage in this case because the community needs some answers and they need them now. The video, which was released mute, showed officers stopping Augustus. That's when they say he started flailing, tried to escape and reached for a weapon which appears as the video pauses. He was then shot multiple times. Police say they recovered a gun at the scene. Johnson blamed the violent reaction of Saturday's crowd on false reports, including that Augustus was unarmed or had a concealed carry permit. He promised a complete investigation. We will be as transparent as we can, but we still have to honor the process and the investigation. So I urge people not to just jump out there putting false information out there because when you do that, you jeopardize not just the police officers, but the community members out there. The officer involved in the shooting has been placed on desk duty while the incident is investigated. That report from uh, Reuters.